everybody. Guess what? Today is the day that I have been. Oh, what is the word? Anticipating with great joy. Today is the day that I get my own truck back. Today is the day that I get your grace. Truck number 799. I can't wait. Ah, man, I die. I just... Ooh, it's been a long, long journey on this truck. I realize that there are better trucks out there on the road than your grace, but I don't know. Something about your grace that just so different. So much comfortable. Climb! 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 801, climb! By the way, I never did get the uh, chance to give this truck a name. Welcome to Maryland, everyone. Everybody, John, if you could hear hello and good afternoon greetings from Frederick, Maryland. Do you notice anything different? I'll give you a couple minutes to rack your brains and figure out what's different. All right, the local time is five o'clock. Temperature is 34 degrees. And uh, I'll, I'll give you a couple more minutes so nobody's in a rush. Take your time, take your time. truck is still in a mess it's still a mess there's so much that I have to put away all right so for those of you who may not know I am back in my own truck permanently assigned to me truck I don't own the truck I'm just strictly a company driver this truck is 799. Her name is Your Grace. Your Grace. Hello, Your Grace. 
Get it? Your Grace? The truck that I was driving this morning, that was 801. Christmas, uh, the boss let me have the other truck, which is set up exactly the way it is. this is, same model, same truck, and the reason is this truck was in desperate need of repairs, and the boss thought it was going to take a while. Actually, he only thought that it was just maybe a week. So his exact words were, "All right, get your temp, you know, get your essential stuff that will last you for a week. You'll be back here next week to pick up your truck." So I only took the most basic, basic uh, equipment that I needed to go trucking for a week. And here we are, this uh, January 23rd. So it's been, yeah, it's been a month, exactly a month. And at the time, I, you guys gotta understand, I don't know if, I think most truck drivers feel the same way. But for me personally, uh, I hate moving from one truck to the other, I really do. It's a lot of work, it's very stressful. And uh, at the time I said, you know, instead of moving from one truck to the other, I could use a one week vacation. So I thought of myself, you know what? I might just rent a car and go home. And I'm glad I did not because if I did, I would have been out of a job for a month, you know? I certainly can't afford to hang around the house for a month without any income. Mama would not be happy. So all said and done, a month later, today's day, um, She's back. They had to change the uh, the coolant was leaking. What else was leaking? Yeah, the coolant was leaking. The oil was leaking. Uh, the EGR or something seal was leaking. And yes, you notice anything different? no more crack there was a big old crack on the old uh, windshield the boss did not tell me that he replaced the windshield so that's a good thing and you know what else I really miss a lot look at that my favorite tool in trucking my spinner courtesy of one of you uh, uh, subscribers out there forgive me forgive me I can't remember who gave it to me but this is a, a original John Deere spinner it's a John Deere spinner the cover has been lost but uh, that was one of the things and the other truck I did not have a microwave I didn't have my my stuff in it and uh, but I've got everything back and now we're headed for Manassas Virginia which is 63 miles away so we are 
to deliver this load I think it delivers at 7 a.m. By the way, had uh, the boss had me all routed completely, the boss already had me pre planned all the way down to Texas. Now, originally, he had me go down to Manassas, Virginia, deliver a load deadhead to uh, White Waves Foods in Mount Crawford, Virginia, and that load delivered all the way to, oh gosh, where in the world was that? Somewhere near the Minnesota state line. Prescott, Wisconsin. So from uh, Mount Crawford, Virginia, delivers to Prescott, Wisconsin. And then, uh, then I was gonna go pick up a load out of Brooklyn Park, Minnesota. And that delivered to Maine's paper in Terrell, Texas. Unfortunately, the Texas load, the Terrell, Texas, the Minnesota to Terrell, Texas load has been canceled. And I might still go to Brooklyn Park to pick up a load going to Colorado. I think that's the, that's the plan. And that's all I have for you at the moment. Oh, what else is going on? Yeah, that's all the update I could share with you. That's all there is to share. Catch you guys later. Welcome to Frederick, Maryland. Our yards, the old yard was supposed to be, uh, used to be down there, but. All right, later. Peace. Hey everybody, John Amigad here. How about a little bit of a quick update. Greetings from Tyson's Corner, Virginia. We are down to 22 miles to Reinhardt Foods in Manassas, Virginia. The local time is 549. Temperature is 39 degrees. We are currently traveling on ex, uh, Highway 495. And we are about to merge onto Interstate 66 West towards Manassas well, Front Royal, Virginia So far so good Delivery schedule is uh, tomorrow a.m. As I previously mentioned that once I get empty in Manassas I am to deadhead to Mount Crawford, Virginia to pick up a load down for Prescott, Wisconsin. And then from Prescott, Wisconsin, I st probably still gonna go to uh, Brooklyn Park, Minnesota and delivers in Colorado. Not 100% sure, but I know I am headed for Prescott, Wisconsin. Until it's, you know, whole plan changes, so. 
All right, merging on to Interstate 66 West, Manassas, Front Royal, Virginia. down to 20 miles to Reinhardt Foods. There's a little, has been a, always been a little bit of a problem of finding a place to park in Manassas. Not a whole lot of places to get a proper parking space. We'll figure it out. Oh, one thing that I've been looking forward to. I'd be sleeping in my own bed tonight. Woo! Sweet, sweet, sweet. Ain't that a beautiful color out there, right? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Manassas, Virginia. Right, we gotta make a right turn right here. Balls Ford Road.
got to go to the end of this and make a U-turn. I think we're good all right good night everybody as always thank you so much for uh, for watching God willing we'll see you tomorrow for now have a good and godly day peace